Hello, we're back with another math lesson. In this math lesson, we are reviewing customary measurement. And we will review customary measurement of length, capacity, and weight. Okay, we have 12 inches, one foot, three feet, one yard, 1,760 yards equal a mile, 5,280 feet equals a mile. In capacity, we have eight fluid ounces, it's one cup, two cups, one pint, two pints, one quart, four quarts, one gallon. And in weight, we have 16 ounces, one pound, 2,000 pounds, one ton. So if you don't remember, you can go back to your chart and find your measurements. Now let's go to the first one. Let's convert customary unit of length. Remember the rule says to change from a larger unit to a smaller unit, we multiply. To change from a smaller unit to a larger unit, we divide. Let's look at our first problem. The first problem is four yards equal blank feet. Now, first we decide if we are going from larger to smaller or smaller to larger. Second, find out how many feet is equal a yard. So we found out that there are what? Three feet equals a yard. So we're going from larger to smaller. We are going to multiply. Four times three equals 12. And that will be our answer. Now, we are going to look at a second one. We're going to 12 inches, one foot. So here we're going from inches to feet, from smaller to larger. So from smaller to larger, we will divide. Excellent. So how many inches is in one foot? 12. So therefore, we divide 12 into 12 equals 1. And that is our answer. Let's look at a third one. Now, five miles blank yard. Now, we remember we, we have to decide if we're going from larger to smaller or smaller to larger. Miles larger than yard. So, therefore, we are going from larger to smaller. We have to multiply. How many yards is equal to a mile? 1,760. So, therefore, we multiply 1,760 by 5, and we get 8,800, and that will be our answer. Now, let's look at capacity. Remember, capacity is how much something holds. So, we have 48 quarts equals blank gallon. Which one is greater? Gallons is greater. So, it means that we're going from smaller to larger. And when we go from smaller to larger, we have to divide. Question, how many quarts is equal to a gallon? Four. So we have to divide four into 48 equals 12. That's our answer. Now, here's another one. Four Pints equals blank quarts. Now, pause the video right now and see if you can work this out. Good. I'm sure you did an awesome job. You got it correct. Now, we have pints and quarts. Which one is larger? Quarts is larger than pints. So, we're going from smaller to larger. So, we know that two Pints equals one quart. So we are dividing four, <clears throat> two into four, and it goes two times, and that will be our answer. Let's look at another one. We have six pints 
blank cuffs. Now pause the video and see if you can work this out. Where are we going first? Smaller to larger, larger to smaller. Yes, we are going from a larger unit to a smaller unit. And what did you have to do? Multiply. Excellent. How many cups equal a pint? Two. Very good. So we are multiplying six times two equals, you got it, 12. Now we're going to do weight now. So the rules remain the same. If we're going from larger to smaller, multiply. Smaller to larger, divide. 15 pounds blank ounces. Which one is greater? Pounds is greater than ounces. So we have to multiply. But the question is, how many ounces is equal to a pound? There are 16 ounces to a pound. So we have to multiply 15 times 16 give us 240. Now let's look at this one. Pause the video right now and see if you can work this one out. 16 ounces blank pounds. Okay, you did it, huh? Let's see how well you've done. We have ounces, pounds. Which one is larger? Pounds. So we're going from smaller to larger. We have to divide. So 16 ounces is one pound. So we said 16 divided 16 equals one. Great job. Let's look at this one. We have 12 tons. Blank pounds. What are we doing here? Larger to smaller, smaller to larger. Tons is bigger than pounds, so we have to multiply. How many pounds is equal to a ton? 2,000. You're correct. So we have to say 12 times 2,000, and that gives us 24,000. Great job.